Kyler Murray won the NFL Offensive Rookie of the Year award, and I'm very proud of him for winning this award. He definitely deserved that award for the great season he had with the Cardinals. He threw for 3,700 yards, and he had 20 touchdowns. So he did a great job as a first-year starter in the NFL, and he's going to continue to do great things for the Cardinals. He also had a QBR of 55, if I'm not mistaken, which is pretty good, because like I just said, it was his first year in the NFL. So he won this award. I'm glad he won. He led the Cardinals to five victories, which is not bad for a team that has a whole bunch of young players on the team. For a team that is definitely in rebuilding mode, five wins is not bad at all. And we know that it's only going to get better from here. Kyler Murray was obviously deserving of the number one overall pick. I'm glad the Cardinals made the right choice in selecting him. He definitely will lead this team to the playoffs in the future. And I'm telling you right now, if you're a Cardinals fan, you should be excited because you're making it to the playoffs. And we definitely cannot rule out the Super Bowl for the Cardinals down the road. This team is blessed to have him as their quarterback. He can run. He can throw the ball. So he's a dual threat. He can read defenses very well. He processes information real quickly. This is who you want as a quarterback. And on top of that, he can throw the football. He can fling the football with the best of them. So I'm glad he won this award. He's definitely deserving of it. Next year, I think the Cardinals will have 10 wins. They'll be 10 and 6. You will see, he will make a tremendous leap. His play will be even better than it was this season. Because remember, he didn't have enough playmakers on offense. He had pretty much Larry Fitzgerald and that was it. He didn't have no Julio Jones. He didn't have Landry at wide receiver. At running back, he had Drake. I mean, Drake was okay, but he's not Derrick Henry. So he did the best with the limited offensive weapons around him. And then the line, as we knew, was shaky. But he was able to deal with all of this and still be productive. So I'm happy for him. The future looks bright for him and the Cardinals. And they're going to make noise in the NFC West. That is for sure. So the 49ers and the Rams and the Seahawks better look out. Because Kyler Murray is coming. And the Cardinals are going to do their best to put a great complete team around him. And when that happens, look out. This team is going to be very difficult to deal with. They're going to score tons of points. The defense will improve. They still got Peterson back there. <clears throat> they've got Buchanan. So they've got some nice pieces there. They still have Chandler Jones. So the defense will do their thing. And Kyler Murray will definitely do his thing. He will score touchdown after touchdown. He will put so much pressure on the opposing team. I don't think they'll be able to hang with him. So like I said, he won this award. He's going to win many war awards. Don't be surprised if he wins the NFL Offensive Player of the Year award. The future is bright for the Cardinals. It's definitely bright for Murray. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Please remember to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Just press that subscribe button below this video. Because I'll be putting out more content like this. And I wouldn't want you to miss out on any of it. So please remember to subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Thanks for listening. I hope that you have a blessed, wonderful day.